Hi again, everybody. It's Craig in the uh, sports cabin on this Friday. We're set for another big college football weekend. And you know, the coaching roller coaster, of course, is in full tilt boogie by this time. They, they do it every year. Jobs are always in some form of disorder unless the guy has an unbeaten team like Kevin Sumlin, who is certainly on the hot seat leading in, but his Aggies look great. Of course, Charlie Strong, not so much. Uh, the T-Sippers are, well, they say coaching now for Charlie is day-to-day. -day. The big shots in Austin ran the AD out of town a couple of years ago, and now the football coach is getting all his meals to go. Uh, let's face it, you lose to Iowa State Saturday, and it really is all over. I don't care if it's midseason or not. Ames, Iowa doesn't produce Big 12 shivers down too many spines. One big-time pronouncer from ESPN called Austin a cesspool. That was in reference to who might take the next job. Well, I think that's a little strong. I just think it has way too many people who think it's cool to drink craft beer, and the city fathers passed an ordinance banning barbecue smoke. I mean, that's got to be uh, about as un-Texan, and it's got dumb written all over it. What will happen in Austin, I think, is what happened in College Station. Guys who get fired end up as heroes. R.C. Slocum is a hero. No denying that. He got fired by the school. You know Austin's going to enshrine Mac Brown. If your coach is a winner, why not let him keep coaching until he's ready to quit? Charlie isn't in that class, mind you, but he knows more about football than some guy writing a check and putting on a UT sweatshirt so he can stand next to a cheerleader on the sideline. Of course, uh, knowledge and winning doesn't include Baylor. UH got rid of Bill Yeoman only to name uh, part of the field for him, and he's got a statue built. I do wish one thing. I wish UH genius T. Herman would have at least called Bill Yeoman and said, Coach, how do you stop a triple option team? I believe Coach Yeoman could have helped last weekend. This is Craig Roberts on Click2Houston.com.